Hey guys, uh, welcome to another haul video. This is a special haul. This is a craft festival haul. So I went to a little craft festival. I'll try to insert some video if I have time at the end. Um, but it was a great time, very pretty setting. It's very hot, very, very hot day. Um, but um, one of the things I got was this cool little frame and um, these are pebbles from um, a local river and it says under the moon and it's got like little there's the moon up there's a little pebble and um like me and my pookie there and um so and the artist is mimi whoever that is that's awesome um okay next up i got these earrings which are probably my favorite purchase of the day i just love those i think they're awesome and these are designs by Sharon. Um, her name's Sharon Albertson. Um, she has an Etsy store, so check her out if if you were interested in that. And, and I love talking to the artists and like meeting who designed my stuff and not just having, you know, a run of the mill everyday thing. So um, she also, let's see, no, this one was Jewelry by Wander. I'm sorry. Uh, this is a different artist. But um, no. Yeah. Okay, yeah. This one's different. All right. This one was um, jewelrybywander.com, and this is a particular type of jasper. Um, it instills patience, she said. So those are awesome little owls there. And I ended up buying another pair from her, but I don't think I brought them in here. I think I wore them yesterday. Um, but anyway, I, I got this cool little little basket here. The little flower in there pressed in it that's pretty cool love that um i got an awesome little tree kind of like just a little secret tree box with the little metal thing in there and just a piece of wood i love that i love hand carved things um speaking of hand carved this little guy he is a wood spirit carving and the artist says that he just lets the wood speak to him and the spirit that wants to come out comes out. So super cute. Um, maybe I should give him a name. You know, I name everything. I don't know. Um, let's see. Next up, we were by the food part. Um, and I got all these little dip mixes, I guess you could say. Um, this it's called Just Crazy Good, and it's justcrazygooddips.com if you're interested. Um, spicy garlic. It says you use one cup of mayonnaise, one cup of sour cream, and one package of the dip mix, and refrigerate for one hour before serving. Three steps. I can do that. Um, this one is Wicked Lobster. Same thing. Mayonnaise, cream cheese. No, mayonnaise, sour cream, and the dip mix. Um, garlic parm garlic pepper parmesan same thing this is the only one that's different this is jalapeno smoked cheddar and for this you add eight ounces of cream cheese one cup of sour cream and refrigerate so um i'm a sucker i know i have sucker right, right there every time but i don't care um you know they have a little sample set up and you got your little pretzel or your dip or whatever you're trying and some are sweet, some are spicy. Apparently, I was in the mood for some garlic or jalapeno kind of stuff. Um, but I sampled everything, and I was really into it. Like, I wanted them all. It was almost time to eat. I was super hungry. And speaking of food, did not do so well on the diet. Um, my boyfriend bought a, um, oh, what was it called? Deep fried Oreos. Um, that just sounds fattening, you know. Um, but they came in like a plate of six, and I only had one, so... It's still bad. It's probably like eating five regular Oreos. I don't know. But um, anyway, still good. Um, and what else? I had some chicken on a stick and some rice. And um, what else did we have? Uh, oh, the big curly fries. But of course, he didn't just get the regular curly fries. He got the loaded whatever. And it had like ranch and bacon and I don't know, stuffed cheese on there. So, but it was really good. Um, we had some lemonade, some... Uh, regular lemonade and then we had some berry lemonade they called it dark lemonade but it was just like full of berries and the guy was like oh do, do, if I drink that does it turn because it, it looked identical to my hair that day and uh, he's like if I drink that does that mean my hair is gonna turn your color I'm like, yeah don't drink it don't drink it 
But uh, anyway, it was a great day. And um, oh, hang on, I'm not going to show you stuff. Uh, this is just a little sterling silver um, spiral ring. I don't know if you can see that. There it is. Um, reminds me of the spiral of life, that kind of thing. I love spirals. I'd love to get a tattoo of a spiral, I think, right here. Um, and then this, I bought a thumb ring. Um, it's just like a little braided band. Don't know if you can really see that, but it's just a little braid. It's not anything super special. I just liked it. Um, these are pretty cool. These are um, adjustable rings, so you can see the bottom there, but they are um, little wood carved rings, and there's one of a tree and one of like a little sunburst, so I really like those, and I just love that one's kind of more of a gold tone and one's a silver. Um, I loved all his necklace carvings and the ornaments and all that, but um, I really just, I don't know, I'm a ring person, so I really like these. So I got those. Um, I think that is it for the festival, but I will show you. Um, I've been cleaning out my basement, so I'm super excited. And this is something that I found from another craft festival uh, that I had forgotten about for many years. And um, so I'm going to use this somewhere in my craft room, maybe just to hold something or I don't know. Um, but I really like that. And I also found, I'm so excited. Like, you know how you clean out your basement and you're just... You just feel accomplished, like you've just cleaned something, you've done something, and I haven't seen this stuff in so, so long, so it's awesome. Um, I found two of these, and these are just like little wall sconce shelves, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do with those, but I'm super excited that I found them. These probably shouldn't be part of the haul, but I'm so excited, I just have to show you anyway. Um, I found her, she's awesome, and she's like a candle holder. Um, but she has a twin and I can't find her. I've been through like a thousand boxes and I don't know. I don't know where she is. So I might just be putting up one. I don't know where I want to put her yet, but I'm going to do something with her because I still like it. Um, I also found this. I actually found a ton of Halloween decorations that I forgot I had. Um, I actually boxed up, boxed up a bunch and gave to my cousin the other day. So, um, but I've got to downsize a little more. But anyway, this guy is super cool. And I think that I'm going, you know how I love skulls and things. Um, I'm probably going to leave him out in my craft room um, year round. So I don't know where he's from. Reminds me of a tag from Michael's, but I'm not totally sure. I don't know. Uh, if you guys know, let me know. I'm just curious. It doesn't matter. I'm just curious. But anyway, what should I name him? He's so sweet. Um, I don't know. YouTube, help me name him. He needs a name. So, the orange skull. Um, I also found these from when I went to New Orleans. And I love masks. Oh, so cool. I'm just fascinated by masks. Um, I'd like to do a whole room of nothing but masks someday. It'd be awesome. If I ever go back, I'll probably will. Um, but anyway, I want to put those in my craft room since... I just found those and you know I just haven't seen them in years so I'm excited um all right I will stop talking and insert a few things from the day oh my boyfriend bought this really cool picture you'll see it it's a little fuzzy I should have taken a picture without the like the plastic on but you can still see it um but it's kind of like a little ocean tiki bar kind of thing and he had Alicia and John put on there so that was pretty cool um and they'll you know like handwrite your names on there or whatever you want it to say. And then these one has a little dog laying over there. It's so cute. Um, but we had a great time and I definitely want to go back maybe next year. So it was very hot, very hot day. It was like 90, 96, I don't know, something. It was hot. But luckily where we were walking, um, there was, it was off and on sun, but there was a lot of shade with all the trees and things. And it was over by the lake. So, or water area, I don't know. Um, but it was a slight, very slight breeze. Um, and luckily when we were eating, we did find a nice shady picnic table. So that was good. Um, and they had everything, you know, set up as much as they could in the shade. So I appreciate that. But anyway, guys, that's my haul for today. And um, stay tuned for a Walmart haul and some other little goodies that I've received from some people in the mail. So I'll talk to you soon. Hey okay, guys, I'm at the craft festival. Things that going on. Well, it was until as soon as I 
gonna turn this on. I think I'm back. <laughs> Wish you guys were with me. Lots of crafts. Look at those pretty brooms. Love that. I love handmade brooms. I collect those. I have to check out that booth. Ooh, I'm getting hungry. I see the food trucks. <laughs> I'll talk to you soon.